Hello guys, it's Hybrid Wayne again. Um, today I'm going to try to connect my e-ink e-reader 13.3 inch to the MacBook Air that I have. It's also 13 inch. Um, and use it as a monitor to see how it would look like uh, under direct sunlight. So. This is the MacBook. It's a 13 inch one. Uh, the old model like 2014 I guess. They look the same but the problem is with the display. As you can see under direct sunlight you cannot see like you can see almost nothing under direct sunlight. So I'm trying to read this article here on BBC website the article called your cat can pick up on how you are feeling so even though it's set on the the brightness set to 100 percent but as you can see like you cannot see it's hard to read outdoors the problem is is of course because of the sun up there as you can see here so what I'm gonna try to do is is connecting the e-reader that I have this is a 13 inch and use it as a display so I've already done that but on a Linux and on Windows but not on Apple Macintosh so here it is how it looks like so this is the comparison let me try to like this put it next to each other so under direct sunlight you can see the difference here between the two displays here it is here's the the MacBook display the MacBook Air 13 inch and here is the e-reader, e-ink e-reader 13 inch. They are displaying the same thing. I'm mirroring the display here on the e-reader. So anything happens here will be mirrored here. So and okay let's check now I'm gonna try to scroll down a bit. <clears throat> go down you see so refreshing the display makes this uh, I don't know this noise but after a while like it takes a time until the image is stabilized but it looks really good I guess like the quality is really good and this one has a really high uh, resolution this uh, e-ink reader so as you can see it's 100% readable even though it's direct under direct sunlight so like look at here and look at here so the second good thing about it is that this is wireless so you don't have to keep your laptop with you you can just <clears throat> keep it indoors and take the screen with you outside so everything I change here you see like you don't have to keep your laptop with you you can keep it indoors and uh, take the keep the e-reader with you outdoors like you are sitting in a uh, in the balcony or in the garden at home or at the university maybe you can keep your Mac indoors so as you can see you see here the resolution especially for photos it's like really high 
and you can what you can do also is yeah you can this is what I've done it is like something from the Middle Ages but you can put it like here like this and I've used like here gummies and Hit it like this. So it looks like as if it was a real display, you see? Of the Mac. So if I go down It has a slower refresh rate than LCDs, but this is one of the cons of uh, e-ink displays. But as you can see, like the visibility, outdoor visibility is like 100%. And the brighter the sunlight is, the better that you would see on the display. Because it reflects the light, it doesn't emit light from the inside. So this is how it would look like from behind. You see? It looks legit, right? So, this is how text editing would look like on it. I will open a text editor. Uh, let's say notes. And here I'll try to write some text. Like this is how it would look like to write on a e so if you noticed it's it has a bit of literacy time it's faster on uh, Windows actually but on the Mac it's also acceptable it depends on uh, the DNC server that uh, you are using. Like here, the quality is really high. This is why it's taking uh, so long to display the images on the e-ink. Like when I write something, here you can see my hands. Here I am writing some something. And like after a while, it will, do, it will appear on the display. So, that was it for today, guys. If you like it, just give it a thumbs up. And have a nice day.